everyone, welcome back. Our last guest is a singer, songwriter, and accordionist from Colombia. He's an alumni from Berkeley College of Music, and he has, well, graced the stages of places such as Carnegie Hall, Madison Square Garden, and more. He's worked with Latin music stars such as Ruben Blades and Mark Anthony, and that's just to name a few. And throughout the years, he's been able to make a name for himself in the Latin music scene. Joining us to tell us about his latest project, we welcome desde Colombia, Gregorio Uribe. Hello. Mm -hmm. Muchas gracias, Rina. So, so good to be here. Thank you for the invitation and big hugs to everybody in New York. I, I, miss, I, I miss the vibe. I miss the, the live music scene. I hope we can all uh, see each other again soon. Yeah, I know. But the beauty of technology is that we're able to share you with our viewers here. Well, it's worldwide at this point because it's going to be online. However, you know, we're pri primarily a Bronx channel. Um, and because you're in Colombia and because of our technology, we're able to at least uh, share your talents with our viewers. So that's the beauty of, of the technology that we have uh, in place. But um, I wanted to know... Full. Huh? Glass, Glass half, half full. full. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's pretty much the way we got to look at things nowadays. Because if not, we, we'll, we'll get lost in, in the abyss. <laughs> yeah. And so I wanted to ask that um, you're in Colombia now, but Colombia isn't where you reside year round, right? Yeah, I've been, I've been for, for many years, I've been uh, between Colombia and New York. I, I love that, that combination of New York is really where I forged my, my career, where I, I started my big band, but also Colombia is where I have my roots and where I, where I get inspired in, especially in the traditional the styles of music. So I love having a combination. Uh, currently, I've been spending more, more time here because obviously due to the COVID, there's, the traveling is, is just a, it's not a, a good or, or easy time for that. Um, but I, yeah, I love the, the combination of both worlds. So basically you were in Colombia when COVID hit and now you're permanently in Colombia. Exactly. I'm here until, until, well, you know, until we can start traveling back again. But I also understand that you just brought new life into the world. Exactly. Oh yeah. So that's another big reason to, to kind of stay. It kind of works well for me to be able to stay put for a little bit. We're very lucky, me and my, uh, my girlfriend, uh, who's a, a, an Argentinian singer-songwriter, Solange Pratt, we had, uh, we had our, first, uh, our first kid, Leonardo. And uh, well, this is actually kind of his room slash music room. <laughs> <laughs> so a lot of music for him, uh, uh, you know, from the beginning. That's lovely. He's born a musician, Ja, it's done. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> well, congratulations, congratulations. And, um, and so uh, let's talk about Damasco, right? That's the new single that you're going to be giving a taste of uh, later. But also, I, I did want to mention that in viewing it, I noticed that you have these amazing graphics attached to the music. And it's a, it's a wonderful dynamic in storytelling. Can you elaborate a little further on like the purpose behind the I don't know, it, it kind of molds itself to looking like a, man, a, a mandala, a, a, a mandala, mm. what is the word I'm looking yeah, for? Mandala, a, a mandala, a mandala, a mandala, mm -hmm. that's the word I'm looking for. Yeah. Uh, and almost like a, an alchemist in search of something, but I know it's supposed to be you. Oh, I love, I love that. I think you're, you're, you're right on point. Well, the first thing is that I basically just got lucky that I found uh, a great uh, illustrator. Uh, his name is Juan Vargas. And um, he had done the cover for my uh, last single. And so I sent him this one. And um, w when I was looking at his work on, on Instagram, I was very inspired that he had a lot of um, things that were like from a book of, 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 of Jung and, and sort of psycho uh, psychoanalysis, what, what? Uh, psychoanalysts or psychotherapy right. or some like sort of magical and, and some like a... Uh, uh, symbols of alchemy and that kind of stuff. So I'm like, oh, this guy is, is got a very interesting and, and original point of view. So when I sent them this and I told them a little bit about what the story was behind the song and all of that, when he sent it to me, I just, I really basically didn't have to ask for any changes, which is not, which is not common. So I think he, he basically, you know, grabbed the image of, of, of myself, of, of, I think of a picture that I sent him. And then he just created this magical imaginary landscape 
And, and there's this sort of, I think the position that he's putting me is in the position of like awe of what's happening, right? Of, of like discovering some light. And I love how abstract it is. And you're saying, you know, it could be like, it was like a pyramid, but maybe like a mandala, but maybe, um, I don't know, like something, it, 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 it gives you it, It's its own experience. Beyond. It's its own experience. And the maybe music like, attached yeah. to it really takes you on a, on a really lovely trip of, of wonder. I agree. Well, yeah, thank you. I, I got very lucky and I, we can't wait to do more, more work with, uh, with Juan because he's, he's fantastic. Well it's, well, it's nice that we mentioned him and, and what's lovely is that we're going to get our own exclusive taste of your new single, right? Um, before we take the break, uh, you want to share with everyone what we're going to be presenting? Sure. So I will, I want to give you guys a little private serenade, an intimate version of, of Damasco. Uh, I, I, I wish and I, I hope that the, the song works, you know, when you, when you actually hear the, 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 the track, you know, there's a lot of percussion, it's very danceable, but I also love the idea that it, hopefully it also works with just, you know, accordion and myself and just the, 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 minimali the minimalistic version where it's like all about the lyrics and, and the melody and, and the accordion. So that's what you're going to hear. Beautiful. Oh, we're looking forward to that. You guys, we have to take a quick break. But when we return, Gregorio Uribe, he's going to perform an acoustic, live, intimate version of his new single, Damasco. Don't go anywhere. 